everyone, we're back. My name is Miss Scarlet Tanager, and I am playing some Through the Woods. I've been needing to play this game for a long time because, if I remember correctly, I think I did the demo on the channel. I can't actually remember. But I've been needing to do the full game, and it got gifted to me on Steam by, I'm pretty sure Molly. I think Molly was going to give it to me, and it was a while ago, but I haven't just gotten around to it with everything that's been going on in my life and blah 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 and nobody cares let's play the game i can't really remember too much about this game except that it's very heavily influenced with by norse mythology which i'm super into because i like to dress up like i used like i was a viking and go out and camp with other people who dress like they're vikings it's a gross oversimplification of the SCA medieval recreationist stuff that I do, but still! Yes, I just threw a shoe. Because I realized as I started playing the video, or starting to record the video, I did not take my shoes off when I got home. And they're three inch heels in boots. It's not a good thing. This is, this is loading, I was just about to say this loading screen is taking an age and a half, but then it decided to stop, so. This game looks pretty so far. Just like the bunnies that are prancing around around my feet. Now that I don't have shoes on. <sighs> the life of a pet owner, y'all. Especially when those pets are housed in the same room as you. No, oh, all right. We're it's our son. I think. I hope this doesn't end up like the park. I'm gonna go exploring, mom. Okay. Okay. Just keep away from the pier. It's old. Our I'm about trails. to get. Oh, I'm playing as the son first. Oh, I'm gonna about. I'm gonna. I'm gonna get. Let's go. Yeah, get kidnapped. I'm going to get kidnapped. Oh no, these controls, yo. I can change the controls at all. This is going to be fun. I hate when games make run or crowd shift and control because my hands, I brought this up in so many videos, but my hands are tiny. So I always remap them to the buttons on my gaming mouse. But I can't remap them in this game eventually, so I just get to deal with my finger hurting after the stream because of the way I have to stretch my hand out in order to depress the run button. I'm exploring, cause I'm an explorers, an exploring explorers. Why would my mother let me just go and do whatever the hell I wanted in the middle of the woods? It's a terrible fucking idea. Let's go into this obvious thing that we saw. Hey look, it's a house. Thing. Treehouse. Missing dad. Ugh. I used to like coming to the cabin better when mom wasn't so lame. She works all the time and sleeps all day. Uh, when I talk, she's only half listening. I don't. I don't know what's up with her. I just want to go home and miss dad. Aww. Well, when your mom has to work all the time, that's a, that's a creepy doll. When your mom's got to work all the time, there's not really anything you can do about that. I mean, she works to pay for your education, or education, your life, your food, your college. I guess that goes under education, but still. So, stop your belly aching. <laughs> At least you got food on the table, kid. So, mom told me not to go straight to the pier. But the game is obviously telling me to go straight to the pier. <laughs> Don't go to the pier, it's old. Goes to the pier anyway. Nope. Okay, coming. Pier! 
I'm on the pier. I'm on the pier. You want to fight about it, Mom? You want to fight about it? No. Okay, she should probably not be on the pier. <laughs> oh, that has the evil zoom in of the evil pier. Like, we're totally not... That's totally not going to be important later. My son is totally not going to be drowned. Ah, oh, God. <laughs> I'm sorry, you guys. It actually hurts my hand. Ah, to depress the shift button like that. So that is strike one for this game. Though that strike gets taken away because this game is gorgeous. I may have to add it back though if my hand keeps hurting. Ow! It makes my hand hurt. Because I have little baby hands. And my little baby hands cannot depress shift for too long before I get a cramp in my hands. My little baby hands. Aww, we're hanging out in the cabin with Mama. And we're totally not gonna fall off the pier and crowd later. Huh. Mom. Not at all. Hey, Mom, wake up. No. Wake up. You've been asleep all day. No, fuck okay. you, kid. <sighs> Pop. Sorry. Why do you have to stay up so late? You're always tired. Espen, I came here to work. You're supposed to be with your grandparents this weekend. Fucking so, rude. Just let me get some coffee. We'll go night fishing down by the lake or something. I just wanted to go to the bathroom, but it's dark outside. There's no bathroom in the cabin? Go get the flashlight and I'll come out with you. The cabin! Look at the stars, Espen. The cabin has a fully functional kitchen, and obviously has electricity and lights, but it doesn't have a bathroom in the cabin? You wait right here, won't you? Of course. No, she won't. <laughs> she ain't gonna do shit. <laughs> Heh. Get it? It's bathroom. So, what do you want to do tonight? Mom, I'm trying to pee here. Don't worry about it, kid. I'm not running away from the kid. We I... could make some hot chocolate. Mom! <laughs> it's very good voice acting for people who aren't speaking their native language. Go away! Just wait at the path. I can't go while you're standing there. <laughs> you told me, little man. If you say so. You told me not to... You told me not to go anywhere. Game. Don't tell me one thing and do something else. Okay, how about here? Oh wait, off the path? Does that mean this way? Oh god, the path. Please don't turn into the path. There you go, my far enough kid? You done, Espen? He's gone. Espen? He's gone. Yep, he's fucking gone. <laughs> Stop messing around, Espen. I'm not in the mood. Keep thinking his name's Aspen, like the tree. I mean it, Espen. Come out. Yep, called it. Jesus, Espen. The what fuck? Are you doing? Where, did, where is he? I can't. Oh, there he is. <laughs> I thought I'd see if I could scare you after all. You were getting there. Let's go inside. I don't know if I want to make you hot chocolate anymore. I was only kidding. I'm sorry. Oh, their accent is adorable. No. Okay. Fuck you, kid. Don't scare me again. And you're washing the cups. Oh, right. I forgot I had a flashlight. <laughs> Can I go down to the pier in the morning? That's a bad idea. I want to try catching crabs. I'm pretty sure you're not going to find any crabs. It's a freshwater lake. Anyway, the pier's broken and dangerous. Please don't go down there by yourself. The pier is like five feet long. But I still want hot chocolate. Even even if the pier was dangerous, I pretend I was a great mother. When Espen was born, I found, to my surprise, I felt nothing. What? Terrible mother! My nightmare had come true, and I was left raising a child I didn't love. Oh, that's fucking rude. My friends became distant, and Espen's father and I began to fight. I resented them both. And one day, Espen and me 
we're alone. But as as been so she's older, a drafter, I architect again to realize something. I did love him. Good. I was gonna say, wait a minute. Him so much, I ached. Also, he the peer, my best friend, my favorite thing. Like. Him. Like five foot long pier. We lost each other. And I don't know if I can forgive myself. Or Espen. My child is a ghost. So the pier is like five feet long, right? Ish. I mean, we were just looking at it. It looked like it was maybe five feet long. Even if you went down to the pier and it broke and you fell into the water, there's no way in hell the water would be deep enough for him to have drowned or injured himself. We have eggs and bacon. You need to make the pier a little bit longer if it's supposed to be a threat. It's probably at the pier. Hi, Mom. You're always asleep when I wake up. It's really boring going out to play. Something terrible is going to happen because my son is going to be of the dead. Like, this is... He, he is most likely dead. And I'm saying this because I've played the park. And I saw what happened in the park. Usually, it means people are dead. What's in here? Open the door. She's got a really nice French braid thing going on. I gotta go find my son. I, <laughs> I cannot open doors! <laughs> door is my one weakness. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. I loved our room at the cabin. Oh. Espen's reflectors For a second I thought the, the fireplace was a fish tank. <laughs> fascinated me. He soaked up the world. From his imagination to the page in pastels and pen. The process always seemed to distill the harsh world into something pure. Or they're just sketches, cause child. Oh yeah, I can go outside that way, but I can't go outside the other way. What? <laughs> Espen? Magically I'm wearing my jacket. Okay, let's go down to the obvious pure. Freezing. What is he doing out in this cold? Obviously, he's Espen? down at the pier. I hope you're not down by the pier. Oh, it took away my ability to run. Thank God, I can rest dangerous. my finger. I can rest my hey. finger. Hey, get away from my son! What? <gasps> Jesus! Oh yes. shit! Espen, get away from him! Espen, I'm coming! I'm. Don't look around. Just fucking jump, jump. <laughs> Also, it doesn't look like my son's been tied up or anything, so... Espen! No! Espen! Can't you just jump out of the boat? I mean, I'm assuming my brother- or brother. I'm assuming my son can swim. Th this is my assumption here, that my son has the ability to swim. But according to this, m my son would not jump out of a boat. He wasn't tied up. He didn't look like he was tied up. Or bound in any way. He was just chilled in the boat, his mom screaming bloody murder in the water. Nah, she'll be fine. I don't need to go to her, even though she is crying out my name. Well, I swam across the lake. Pretty powerful legs. So, it's an, this is a Norse boat. Obvious Norse boat. It's not a trireme, that's Roman. There's a specific name for that kind of boat, and I should know what it is because I used to know what it was, but I can't remember what it is right now. Don't worry about telling me, I'll probably just Google it after this. I was gonna say, no way in hell my phone works. <laughs> yeah, I was like, no no way in hell the phone works. So the one time she goes to the cabin with her mom, this shit happens. Obviously it is, and I'm going to go straight forward and find my son and probably get murdered in the process. Because I remember giants from the demo. Hopefully they are not frost giants. Because I don't want to talk to Loki right now. It seems like a terrible idea. Where the hell is my son? My god, this place is huge. Well, I can't jump, but I can run like a mofo. Hello? Espen! 
wait a minute. 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 I can read this. I can read this. Hold on. I used to be able to read this. I can't read it so well right now. I'd have to. I'd have to translate it. I'll probably translate it after the video. And maybe if I remember, I probably will forget during editing. But if I remember, I will probably put it in the video. But it just depends on whether or not I remember to actually translate it or not. <sighs> but yeah, Norski. It looks like it's Elder Food Park, but I'm really bad at telling the difference <laughs> between it and the other two or three kinds of Norse runes. Cause it's been a while since I've studied it. The fuck is there an entire village here? Also, where's my son? Hey! Break open everything. Hello? Voila. Hello? Nope. Oh, I know somebody who actually has a bed like that. With the little slots. Mostly because that's what they use in their at camp outs. Okay, why is there an entire place like this? In modern day Norway. Assuming, assuming modern day Norway because backpacks and hot cocoa. <laughs> uh, could you, could you open? There we go. This is not a good place to be. Oh, wait a minute. I vaguely remember this area from the demo, except it was nighttime. Still didn't see anything though, so. Better look around, hmm, or just run straight through the whole place. No? Nope. Oh boy. Oh hey look! A stick! Actually it's a bit bigger than a stick. Shh. Also, my character can run for days. I love how games nowadays have started to slowly get rid of the stamina function of running. It's like, no, I can just run for days, it's fine. Um... Torstein. Okay. Old Eric. The old pastor came to the village yestereve. Yestereve. The craven whoreson took Raider's boy away. The bastard. No one saw him come. Though we said I watched some weeks ago, the boy didn't make a sound, the wretched thing. Just like mine didn't. We all... We'd all mind to go up there at last and put an end to this before the gates. The cursed gates won't open to those such as us. All we can do is bide and hope Raider's boy was the last. The corruption of the man, his heart if he has one, must be rotted as a, de as a month dead swine. And our gods do nothing. A curse on the whole festering pile of them. A curse on the murdering bastard Eric. So they can't get through the gates that this Eric dude is at. I actually know quite a few people named Eric since so this is funny to me. But... Obviously, Eric came and killed all your butts. Folk tale in the town where I was born about a man called Old Eric. I've heard the Old Eric tale. They said he would sneak into the village at night yep. and steal away children who misbehaved. Yep. My parents used to tell me that I had to be good, or Old Eric would come and take me. At the time, it didn't even cross my mind that the person in the journal could be the same man from the folk tales. But later. Later, I wasn't so sure. Yep. Time for some supernatural shit to happen. Um, I, I, okay, I was like, I am stuck. Why am I stuck? I'm coming, my boy. I'm coming, Aspen. I know his name's Aspen, but I want to call him Aspen because I like treats. <sighs> Anything in here? Oh, hey, there's something in here. No, oh dear. Spider glimmer from the watchtower in the night. Must be that strange rocker man lighting his lanterns again. The way he skulks around in the dark makes me grip Nebo tighter. But he's the only one who keeps the paths lit and carries off the dead. He's been doing it longer than anyone can remember, though no one knows why. Hardly a one sees him about it either. As he works- as he only works in the back black of night. <laughs> the oldens leave baskets of bread outside the fence now and then to keep him fed. Always gone the next morn, unless I watch it through the night. Then it goes stale and gets taken by the crows. Seems as seems as much as I watch out for the old racker, he has his eyes yet better trained on me. Okay. See, the fact that this is all still here... By the way, I've helped set up buildings like this before. 
I'm not even joking. But the fact that this looks dilapidated, but it's not decayed, so it's not like oldy old. And the fact that there is still bowls on the table. But no food. Oh, hey, a sword. Grab the sword. Honey, grab. I don't care if it's made of wood. Grab the freaking sword. Swords are good. Swords, swords are swords of defense items. Even though I'm pretty sure we don't get to have a defense item in this game. Actually, that sword is made of very rusty. <laughs> Never mind. Did I go? Did I come from this way? I think I came from this way. Did I? No. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. Okay. I I did not come from. Oh, wait. What do you think? This is Espen's. He must have dropped it. I'm coming, Espen. That's. Snowman reflectors. Why does he have the why? Espen loved his reflectors. Oh, good thing. Collected them from magazines and cereal boxes, and I bought him a couple from the gas station by our house. He'd hang them from the curtain pole at the cabin and wave his flashlight over them at night to watch them shine. I could hardly believe any of this was happening. But what this is a bizarre hobby for a kid? Around, was his. What I couldn't know at the time was that he'd left me more. A trail. And that as long as I stumbled across these reflectors now and then, that Espen was still alive. Da da da! Or, oh Jesus. Oh Jesus. Um, Mirkstead. I should be able to read this. I'm, I feel ashamed that I can only remember half of the symbols. <sighs> I probably won't have enough time to go back and translate them. Because I have finals next week, but still. I need to be some good good looks at them if you guys want to go translate them yourself. Well, it's getting darker. Wait a minute. Didn't I wake up in the morning? Why in the hell is it already nighttime? Or well, Shit. Looks sunset. Like bastard pulled the bridge across. Of course he did. Too far to it's jump. fucking rude. I'll have to go down. Too far to jump. Bullshit. <laughs> I could jump that. Oh right. Wait. No, I don't have a flashlight. Why don't I have a flashlight? <laughs> Sigh. Okay, I can't see. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Norsky text! I still can't read all of it. Crap. <laughs> I'm a dishonor on my family. Is this a way? Okay, this is a way. Good, because I can't seem to use the frickin' flashlight still. What? Okay, then. So, light's coming in from up there. Oh, wait, this is the- Yep, flashlight. 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 Yes, flashlight. Uh-oh. And there's the jacket, too! He must be freezing. Poor kid. I got a flashlight. Or low game. There is no I in denial. What? There is no I. Yes, there is an I in denial. What are you talking about, game? You're crazy. There's no I. I just got an achievement. I, I think it popped up on the recording too. But there is no I in denial, except it's the fourth letter in denial. Espen must be cold without his jacket. No shit. Norway is freezing. And I saw Norway here. I haven't actually been there. Around. It felt like something inside me broke. I suddenly realized oh, shit. this was really monkey. happening. He had been taken from me. Shit, all the monkeys. His coat. His little coat lying in that dark place. I was his mother. I was supposed to protect him. 
they trusted me, and I let them down, as I had oh. so many nope. times before. His jacket was a symbol of my failure. I promised myself I would find him and bring him back. Or instead of I just hoped being a symbol as I could keep. of your failure, it could be a symbol of the fact that he took his freaking jacket off and now he's really cold. This way. What? Be what? Guys, I found the end of the world. <laughs> Look, I found I found the edges of the textures. <laughs> I've I've discovered I've discovered a gap into the void. And stare at it. Before it stares at you. <laughs> okay, I thought I was supposed to follow that monkey. Evidently I was supposed to follow the other monkey. But now I'm like lost. But I do see big light over here. So maybe I was supposed to follow right monkey and not left monkey. Oh well. Oh, water! What do you mean I can't go in the water? Excuse you. You can let me have no I just made a giant circle, didn't I? Yep. Wait, is that another end of the world? No. There's only one end of the world. Oh! The water make a sa made a sound at me? Freaking rude. And scared me. Hey look, one of these are you yep, I was gonna say, are you going to turn into lightiness? Thursvik. Okay. Am I gonna get attacked by a giant yet? I I distinctly remember a giant. In fact I kind of remember a giant chasing me into a pit like this. Not exactly this pit, but... What is it? Smell gross? Oh, gross! That's why it smells gross. Well, hopefully it's not my, my son cooking on the fire. Because that would not be a good. In fact, I am pretty sure that would be a bad. Oh, look. Those are human. Well, shit! Guess my son's gonna become dinner. Um, I feel like I should be able to, to, to crap, there we go, I can't crouch. Oh god, that's, that hurts my hand even more, why? Okay, shaking on my handbrake. Because I can't remap my controls as far as I can, t I might be able to do it from an any file, but... Oh well. Oh well. I'm just waiting for something to try and find me and catch me and kill me. Could you, could you not? The music is getting so- oh dear. Hey, I play Brutal Legend of Nor this is going. Gathered Norway to one kingdom. Oh dear. More achievements. So then I supposed to go here? Oh. Okay then. Oh, wait a minute. I see the light in the distance. Very, very, very far in the distance. Oh, fuck! Hi. I got an achievement called Christian Blood. <laughs> Even see me die. I didn't even realize he was chasing me. <laughs> oh, oh, and that's probably what this is right here. Okay then. Hmm. BT dubs, y'all. My character didn't make a single comment. And the fact there is a motherfucking giant. She's just like, nah, I'm a chill. It's fine. Okay, game wants me to go this way. <laughs> oh, hi, giant! And I'm dead. Uh, the smell. Oh, the smell's fine. 
And then you're gonna go, oh my god, human bones. Okay, for, oh my god, human bones? Oh, she did. Okay. Ow, my finger. See, I just stretch my hand like this as far out as I can in order to depress the control button. That's why you always... It's accessibility, you guys. You always put button remapping in your games. For all of you future game designers, always put button remapping in your games. Especially if it's PC. Actually, if it's any console, really, but I think it's easier to do on PC. Okay, so there's definitely a giant... I hear him. What's up? I'm gonna try and sneak behind in the way he came because I feel like the game wants me to go the way the giant came from. I don't know why it feels like that. It feels like the game wants me to go this way. I don't want to get killed. Wait, I see a light in the distance. I saw a very brief flicker. Up, up there. Yep, up there! Okay, I'm not being chased by a giant. Good. I, th I think I can turn the light on now. <laughs> I didn't want to turn the light off if the giant was right behind me because then he'd go, Oh my god, it's you! And dead. What the fuck? I saw that from all the way over there. Really? I can't read the... Thursvik? Something scratched out. Well, I got told to go to Thur... I, the other big glowy stone said Thursvik. But I'm gonna go to the scratched out place. Oh. There's nothing here. No, wait, yes there is. Yes? Maybe? Hello? Am I just going back the way I came? No, I'm not! Aha! Excellent. Not excellent. Oh! I broke the world again! Did I? Okay. For a second, it looked like I broke the world and phased halfway through the door. Let's see if I can do it again. Uh, 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 wait, uh, uh. There it goes! I can see through the door! <laughs> Why am I so good at breaking games? I wonder if I need to go through this door with all the unfinished textures on the other side. Oh, why am I terrible? What? <laughs> I just noticed the moon and the fact that it has a gigantic chunk taken out of it and it looks like it's got some bling. <laughs> I vaguely remember a Norse story about that. Am I... suddenly... somehow... on another part of Yggdrasil? I know how it sounds. But it's true. All of it's true. Hey, I believe you, honey. Mostly because I'm watching it. I can't explain it. I can hardly believe it. But it happened. I was going to say, now she makes a comment on that. When I was young, I found some photos of my parents in an old shoebox at their house. I was looking for Christmas presents. Aww. They looked so young and in love before I was born. <laughs> before! I remember before. they didn't look like the people I thought I knew. There was something different about them I couldn't understand. I was lifting a veil, and I knew these pictures were not for my eyes. Uh oh. The island was like that. The journals. Oh. The troll, the broken moon. I wasn't supposed to see that. That was a troll? I thought that was a giant. I was intruding on something secret. 
Yeah. I didn't belong there. Well, bitch just stole your son, so you have a pretty goddamn good reason. Hey, is that a gun? No, it's a plank of wood. <sighs> Sigh. Hey, look! Giant pile of hay with a hole in it. Still gotta go find my son, though. Could you fucking not? Could you fucking not? <laughs> There's another reflection. Or McGird! Okay, he would have had to put effort into into putting that down. So part of me scared little man. I'm coming. Part of me thinks that that's not actually him. That she ne like whoever captured him is leading me somewhere, probably to strangle my son. Because I've played the park, as I have said three or four times in this episode already. I know what happens when one plays the park. Oh! Found a thing! Oh, and there's a note. The water, the water, sun- You know shit! It tried to jump scare me back there. So now I'm in the- wait, wait a minute. I think I- oh, why don't I have my flashlight on? I think I vaguely recognize this place. Or a place very much- what the fuck? Um... Hi, bro! So, um... I'll do this in the next episode! <laughs> That'll be it for now, so my name is Scarlet Danager, and this is starting to get spoopy, and there's a, just a hanging dude chillin'. And I've been playing some through the woods, so I'll see you all in the next video.